and it's this simple look and it pings up that's me at a silo at a side angle because the phone's vertical so i've got the phone like stood on one of those phone stands vertically so we can change that so let's just go to right click go to transform and then we'll rotate nine degrees clockwise and then i'll put myself in the corner and now obviously a bit big but then i mean i don't want the roof so you can crop so if you hold the alt key when you drag the corners it actually crops the image there you go crop myself let's do a bit of cropping at the bottom and then put myself in the bottom corner i'm chewing a lot of gum at the moment I'm trying to give up smoking always anyway so there we go now <clears throat> You can fiddle around with the audio. I haven't played with. I haven't done the audio on this. I'll get you this far with it. I'm sure you can do the audio through the camera, but I just didn't get that far with it. I wanted to just go through the whole thing. But yeah, I mean, I'd probably do the audio through a separate mic anyway, and then you just plug that in and record through that. Anyway, so that's that's all good to go, and then start recording. So we've got the same settings as before, and now what we can do is click Steam, launch Dredge again. And that will come up now. Obviously, you know, you don't see it in game. I mean, this is one of these things where you want to record yourself, but you're not seeing it over the top of yourself. The game, I mean, normally when you do this, you'd probably have a secondary computer to do this and stream over the top and look at your chats. But this is like the simplest and the cheapest solution to do this. So you can do those picture in picture videos 